Guys, welcome back. Uh, this is a little different. We are here at Annapolis Cars and Coffee pretty early in the morning and Slept this special showed up. So a buddy of mine just bought a C8R and uh, Nick if you're watching this, it's pretty hilarious because he just asked me if I wanted to buy this exact car. So it's it's right over here um, So the question is what do you guys think about the C8R and in comparison also to the regular Z51 package so uh, I have this rapid blue 2021 C8. Uh, it's kind of a similar spec. Obviously, these are a limited edition as of 1,000. So let's take a closer look. Uh, maybe do a comparison between the two because they're very similar. So let's take a closer look at this uh, 2022 CAR. They are pretty uh, interesting to look at. So. In comparison, this is my 2021 C8 in Rapid Blue. Um, with this package, I don't believe you can change the interior. So the interior is pretty unique. So guys, what do you think? Would you choose this interior for your uh, C8? Or would you choose it with the C8R? Uh, I have to say so far I've seen it in person. I really do like this interior. This is pretty unique to this interior. This is the only one I know of where you have the Alcantara and suede on the bottom and then you have your leather on top. So if you guys have seen any other interior option for C8s that have this uh, suede on the bottom and then leather on top, let me know. I'm really curious. And looking at the center of the seat, uh, it's more of an off-white. This is not a bright white as it probably shows off in camera. So I don't think, in my opinion, it's going to be hard to keep this clean. You also see suede Alcantara here as well and then leather on top. So that's pretty unique. I, I really like how they designed this. Uh, for mine, it's just all Alcatara on the top. It's not divided in between both. Um, I'm trying to see if I see anything else that's slightly unique. And unfortunately, we're starting to get some rain. So we're taking a closer look at mine. You'll see it's Alcatara on the top, Alcatara on the bottom. Um, so would you choose this interior type or something similar to this? Or would you choose the interior that's in a C8R? That's a good question. Uh, I like my interior uh, as far as being dark it's not hard to keep clean though it is getting kind of dirty because I drive it so much I do get some slight wear and tear over there on the competition seats working our way back to the engine it has the Magride carbon fiber engine appearance package he decided to paint the engine cover yellow which I actually like I think it's pretty good and then you have the high wing and you have your special numbering this is number four this is paying homage to the GT series of where Chevy is absolutely dominating the series right now. So kudos to them. And this color, I absolutely love this color. So if we're taking a look at my engine compartment, it is very similar to his. Uh, obviously he painted the engine cover, uh, so it doesn't really look too much different. Look at these rocker panels versus these. I don't know, you guys tell me what you think, which one you guys like. And like I said, the rims, pretty similar. These are mine. And these are what comes with the C8R. Same brake calibers. And of course you get your special badging. This is gonna be a rare opportunity to uh, see this particular spec, C8R and mine uh, next to each other. And then of course this comes with the stripes as well. To my knowledge, I don't think you have an option. I think you have to get the stripes on these. But this car version carbon fiber would be gorgeous so so guys what do you think do you like the color do you like the interior would you get this package versus just spec it out at regular c8 or would you get this because approximately only a thousand of these are made so that's it guys uh that's just a quick review of the c8r 2022 uh let me know what you guys think and i'll see you guys at the next upload